Hey guys, it's Nathan and Danica from the Ticket to Travel. Today we're heading back down to Heitora from Kathmandu on uh, one of the craziest roads we've ever seen. Um, so you can see it with us. See above Danica if you can. There is a, there you go. There's our GoPro that we got yesterday. And we're going to try to film it. And what we're going to do is, it's a four hour journey. One of the hours and roughly half of the kilometers of the journey we're going to travel without using our engine. Join us. Um, unfortunately, all of our videos from our GoPro were deleted. We had multiple projects back to back and deleted them before making sure that they were all moved onto our computer before moving on to the next project. A really sad but important lesson learned. We did this project twice actually, timing the trip from Kathmandu to Hedora and we both times we managed to do it with the engine off for an hour so we know that it's accurate we know that it's true we were really hoping to be able to show you i had to wear that contraption on my back and all the carry all the heavy gear for the whole trip um it wasn't a total failure we still have little clips of stuff that we did that we filmed along the way on my phone so yeah i hope we can throw that together and you can still enjoy those little tidbits but we've learned our lesson and hopefully we can still make this into somewhat of a video. Now we know for next time. We're having our first pit stop. We're in Farping. Uh, we had to turn the camera off a bit. As in Kathmandu, there was so much load shedding. Uh, so we had no power to charge all our new devices. So we have to limit how much we record. We'll see how well we can do. But first pit stop, then we'll have a second one right at the top of the mountain, and that's coming down is when we'll be able to shut off our, our engine the most. We're now going to that road right there. This road we're taking now is a shortcut down to Hitora, and behind me you can see a lake, and at the end of it is a road, which is actually a dam. So... We're going to go down to the first checkpoint in the blue building down there. After that, we'll have to turn off our camera because it's an army-controlled place. And we have to walk our bike across that road down there. Then after that, it's straight up the mountain until we take our next break. These are fish that were caught from the lake from the dam. Fresh fish. Uh, big different. Uh, oh, different his name is uh, Biget. 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 Uh, it's common carp. Common carp. Yeah. Carp and Biget. Yeah. Cool. We're here at a rest stop for our second break. Mm, secondary lunch, I guess. We're probably going to get some tea. Maybe donut, something like that. Or eggs. Uh, we just passed the dam, everything was successful there, so we're going to take a break and we have about an hour and a half left before Hitora. We could probably do it in less. It's all downhill from here. This is where it gets crazy. We had our last pit stop, now we're heading down the hill and this is the part that we'll be able to have our engine off for the most time, but we're doing pretty good already. I think we're close to a half an hour, if not more, with our engine off and uh, this is the biggest chance for it. Tune in. Five hours at least have gone by since we left this morning in Kathmandu. We had our, we had our GoPro off for a while. So when we had our GoPro off, we were using the timer on my uh, awesome Nokia phone. And we did over 20 minutes uh, without the engine, without the camera running, so. Uh, We'll actually know if we made our goal of at least an hour without the engine running when we do our editing. So that will come later. But this is the beginning of Heitora. Uh, we won't be coasting in or anything, so we're pretty, pretty much uh, wrapping it up. Hey guys, we just made it back home finally after a long day. But uh, the roads were okay. It was a little crazy. But we enjoyed it. It was great uh, learning how to use all of our stuff. And yeah, we hope you liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, comment if you want, and uh, please subscribe. Tell your friends, let them subscribe too.
Join us next time when we figure out our equipment better and know what we're doing a little better. So that things will improve. Thanks for being patient. Thanks for watching. Thanks for visit. <laughs>